say, 2B. What? When do you think you'll be willing to call me 9s? 9S works just fine. Well, yeah, but... Man, this job can be pretty rough sometimes, huh? We don't get to choose our assignments, and you should work on keeping your opinions in check. Your ha aren't allowed to be emotional, remember? I think some of us are better at that than others. This must be the commercial structure Pascal was talking about. The records say it was once a facility known as a shopping center. No getting through here. Maybe there's some kind of mechanism we could engage? If we were human, we probably would have gone shopping and such here, right? More meaningless conjecture. <laughs> You're so serious, 2B. You know that? Alert. Multiple machine life forms detected above our position. All hail the Forest King. All hail the Forest King. Who the heck is the Forest King? You're getting distracted. Well, what do you expect? I'm a scanner. Combat was never meant to be my forte. Check this guy. He's just running away. to explode! <sighs> huh? Hey, where am I? Um, what's that? Hey there, guys. What's up? This thing's weird, Tubi. Let's kill it. Wait, what? No! Good idea. Okay, what was that? Looks like the forest is just ahead. I will, to be.
These machines. They were talking about a king, right? I saw what looked to be a castle further in. Maybe we should take a look. saying to be. What's this?
So we're vets now? That's new. I assume you have at least some idea where to start looking for animal medication? We'll probably need to recreate old human recipes. We should be able to find something in the commercial facility ruins. supposed to reach that castle. <laughs> so those machines had a king? But how can a concept like loyalty be understood by a machine? This looks like a king's castle, all right. Yeah. <laughs> 
Watch out for hostile enemies, 2B. Roger that, 9s. Huh? Wait, what did you just say? Roger that, 9s. Wait, no, that's not what you said. You said 9s. Or at least something close to. Cut the chatter and engage the enemy. Ugh.
Is this... their king? <laughs> Tupi! That's... an android! A Yorha type android. Alert. This unit is currently wanted by Yorha. Annihilation recommended. Annihilation? But why? Let's go, 9S. To be? <laughs> Bunker to 2B and 9S. We've picked up a signal from the black box of a fugitive known as A2. What you see in front of you is your enemy. But she's... She deserted us. She's destroyed multiple pursuit androids. Now kill her before she kills you. you betray us command is the one that betrayed you let's go after her to be Got away. Operator, this is 9S. Patch me through to the commander. Roger that, 9S. I'm sorry, Commander. We failed to defeat the fugitive. I see. Well, at least you're both safe. That's an incredibly powerful unit you just faced. You should probably keep your distance in the future. Commander, why did A2 desert the force? I'm afraid that's classified. Oh? Huh. To be? Yeah? Let's go ask Pascal about A2. He might know something. All right. Whether in wind or rain, thunder or snow, or even 
even amidst the rising flames of war. They were always together. They never understood why. And yet they spent their lives nestled together. Forever. Forever and ever. Um, Pascal? This is 9S. Oh, you survived. How wonderful. Yeah, we're fine. But there's something we want to ask you about. Of course. Anything. Actually, it needs to be in person. Hmm. Understood. I'll open the gate we built to deter enemy invaders. You'll be able to reach the village through there. That must be the gate Pascal opened for us. be faster if you just take a look at I see. Information about this age we all understand. However, she's my apologies. I see. Let's stay sharp and head back to the resistance camp. We should run a check on our consciousness data and resupply. Why did you ask Pascal about A2? Huh? It's not recommended to interface with machines without consulting command. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. Though I suppose such intense curiosity can be admirable, in its own way. <laughs> Thanks, 2B. Still, machines are the enemy. Don't forget it. Operator 210 to 9S. This is your regularly scheduled contact. Yeah, yeah. No problems here. Copy that. I also need to inform you that the commander offers her personal praise for your recent achievements. As a direct result, we are currently considering boosting production of your model. Really? I'm happy to hear it. I couldn't have done it without your support, Operator. You're always so cool under fire, not to mention beautiful and... Flattery is unnecessary. Operator 210, out. I really meant it, though. What was all that about? No idea. So this machine mother has a child, eh? It's surprising to see them form familial units like that. I wonder if they'll let us examine their brain circuits if we bring the kid home. Your scientific curiosity is getting out of hand, 9S. Joking! I'm joking! Mostly. Report. 
Mail notification. Oh, to be. Our android forces currently have a case. It should be back here. The resistance is assisting, so I'd like to ask you to- Seriously? Dead serious. There's a- And with all the machine activity lately. Of course. If you're already- Anyway. She wants intel on A2, does she? Where should we start? We could check out the energy reactions generated during battles. Why must we read all these books, brother? Knowledge expands horizons and enriches existence. But can't we just transfer all this data over instantly? Into your head, perhaps, but not to your heart. Uh, I guess. Hmm. Hey, so... Yes? My name? Eve? This book says it's a woman's name. Shouldn't we be called Cain and Abel or something instead? Humans wouldn't change names so easily. Besides, you should be proud of the name Eve. Huh. Well, if that's what you think, then I'm fine with it. Glad to hear it. Um... Is there something else? After we're done reading, can we go out and play? I'm sure it'll be tons of fun. All right, but only after we're finished. You mean it? Then I'm gonna try extra hard to finish this. Extra, extra hard! You do that. The bedrock here was bombed out in the last war. Looks like the whole city is starting to sink as a result. Target missile sighted. Is that what we need to protect? Let's take him out already so I can be home in time for dinner and a bath. Androids don't need to bathe. As long as you perform regular cleaning and maintenance, bathing is unnecessary. Yeah, but come on, 2B. It still feels good.
I think that's the last of the machines. 2B, 9S, come in. Commander? Emergency orders incoming. The carrier ship that was set to resupply has come under attack. It's currently being engaged by a swarm of machines. I've asked all Yorha troops in the city ruins for assistance, and I'll need you to provide backup as well. I'm sending flight units and coordinates now. Good luck. Out. You see? Total slave driver. Whoopsh. If she didn't order others around, what kind of leader would she be? Hmm. If you say so. a large-scale enemy inbound. Looks to be 2.8 clicks southwest of us. Unit destroyed. Reverting back to area reconna- Wait, I'm still picking up a large enemy presence. Didn't I kill that already? What on? If it's that big, we should be able to see it. Well, that's new. <laughs> Is 
Is that a machine? It's freaking huge! Blocking close range attacks with EMP blasts. We've got to find another way to damage it. Operator 210 to 9S. Command has decided to stage a direct satellite laser strike on the hostel. We need you to destroy the enemy EMP generator so we can lock onto the target. EMP generator? Sending the coordinates to your map now. EMP generator target confirmed. Marking on map. Proposal. Destroy the generator quickly. elimination of electromagnetic interference. Stand by for incoming satellite laser strike. Oh, come on! It's got an electromagnetic barrier over its whole body? Having trouble over there? Are you Yorha? Hunter Squadron deploying out of North 12C Defense HQ. I'm the commanding officer, 4B. Don't worry, we'll take it from here. To be, let's leave this area to the reinforcements. I have an idea. You and I should meet up at the spot I just marked. We've got mortars lining the shoreline here. All the EMP shielding in the world won't help against close-range mortar fire. Got it. I'll help aim. <laughs> this thing's armor is too thick. We need more firepower. 2B. Let's try for a more direct approach. Direct? Oh, right. That's right. Lay down some fire in its stupid mouth.
me! <laughs> we got a bail, 2B. This is bad. Sure, but I need you to destroy the EMP unit on that thing's back. Otherwise, they're just going to go off course. Activate missile controls. Prepare to launch. Missile controls engaged. Launch ability confirmed. Fire! rescue party for the missing Yorha members at once. To be. Minus. Don't die on me. The child held sway over enormous strength. But sadly, he was also a little bit broken. He spent his long days hurting those around him. He tried his best to be good and kind. But despite his efforts, things never seemed to turn out. They told him he was unwanted. They abandoned him in the deep, dark ocean. And from the cold at the bottom of the sea, he cried out. 
Mother. 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 But his voice never reached his mother. This is Tactical Support Unit, Pod 042, assigned to 2B. This is Tactical Support Unit, Pod 153, assigned to 9S. We pods often participate in the same battles. Exchanging our situational data would theoretically allow us to plan combat strategies in a more efficient manner. Proposal. Data should be transferred regularly between Pod 042 and Pod 153. Analysis. This idea is sound. Proposal accepted. Records will be organized in time for the next situational exchange.
Each of the machines treated their treasures with great care. One treasured family above all else. Another treasured its older sibling. Another treasured its own beauty. But one more machine treasured something unique above all else. Hate. Is this... death? So dark. So cold. Proposal. Engage memory core diagnostics. Yeah, yeah. A single reply is sufficient for acknowledgement. Fine. Memory core diagnostics complete. No issues detected. Good. Proposal. Engage visual sensor diagnostics. You got it. Visual sensor diagnostics complete. No issues detected. All checks complete. <sighs> Took long enough. Don't you think it's overkill to perform a full data overhaul? Unit 9S was seized by the enemy and placed in a non-controlled state for an extended period of time. There is a high probability of corruption by an enemy logic virus. All right, all right. Cram it. Anyway, I just gotta sync up with the bunker server and then I'm out of here, right? What was that? Unknown. Halt the data sync. Alert. Data synchronization is mandatory for all your high units. Yeah, I know that, but we just got some kind of weird noise. Halt the data sync for 2B as well. Affirmative. Let's figure out where that noise came from. Just to be sure, you know. Open a port to the server. No time to examine everything. Better stick to the main data nodes. What's a barrier doing here? Hmm. Looks like records for supplies shipped to the moon. Strange. There were a ton of empty containers. That's weird. Why would they do that?
Detected. Your high unit storage records. What's the point of all this heavy security? All the black box data has been deleted, but it looks like everything else is here. Huh? A new port just opened. Detected. Council of Humanity and Project Yorho Records Index. Alert. We are not authorized to access this data. Man, this stuff is all wrong. I need to check this out too. Attack barrier? Really? Why the heck would they install one of those in this server? Let's see. Looks like info about how the Council of Humanity was formed as part of Project Yorha. Wait, isn't that backwards? Close the server connection and activate my body. Affirmative. Ah, 9S. Operator? What happened? We recently detected large numbers of machine life forms throughout the factory area. We received a support request from 2B soon thereafter, but have been unable to respond due to poor reception. All right. I'll try to gain access from the main terminal. 